you believe this, Nani? This is going to be our site this summer. I know. This is going to be cool. This is going to be amazing. <laughs> gorgeous view on this little pond. I mean, it's not big, but you can't beat brand new electrical boxes. They've worked really hard. Kevin, Kevin's yeah. put a ton of work in with the electricity. Yeah. Slide, slide out will be on this side. We're and then, be looking out in the slide out this direction. So, yeah. yeah. So when you're setting at the dinette, this is what you're going to be looking at right over here. So this will be, this will be your patio side. And it looks like they've been working on trying to get some grass growing. Tell you what, though, talk about a big site. The next yeah. trailer's way down there. Yeah. Um, Envisioning, you know, our camp rug, picnic table, chairs, whatnot, fire pit. Yeah. Looks good. It's gonna be nice. If you've been following our channel this uh, spring, you know that we made a major announcement that mm -hmm. we're not we're not going traveling as much this summer. No, we're gonna stay home. We're gonna stay right here. And this is going to be our site for the entire 2023 camping season at Happy Acres Campground in Angle, Indiana. Absolutely. So we're gonna be showing you around a little bit today. The campground is not officially open. We thought we'd come out, check out the site, figure out where Tex is gonna be going and figure out what all we need. But we're also gonna walk around and kind of show you some of the improvements and the entire summer, we're gonna be documenting life in an RV park. Yep, it's gonna be a blast. So, you know, one of the things I think people don't think about is we all show up as campers at the campground, but we don't really think about the amount of work that goes into not only keeping the campground up on a daily basis. So like resetting it for the new season. Yeah. Yeah. Where we're standing right now has always been one of my favorite places to camp at Heavy Acres. I love it here. Yeah, they call them the skybox because technically we're in one of the highest yeah. points in the campground and you're kind of separated away from the rest of the campground. Right, it's like you're kind of just tucked back, you got the tree line behind you and you're spaced out well up here, you got the nice sun on a nice sunny day, it's just melting. There's just six <laughs> sites up here and they're water and electric only, mm -hmm. but it's like for the six campers who get to camp up here, you kind of have your own little private area. Yeah. And these sites are super wide with lots of green grass, your fire pit. And so, yeah, last year we loved booking sites up here. Yeah, we had some campers up here, friends of ours, and it just felt like our own little tiny campground up here. But these new sites that they put in might just be my new favorites here at Happy Acres. Why is that, huh? Well, let's show everyone. It's three brand new back end water electric sites on the newly expanded pond here. You'll be able to sit with your campfire at night and look out at the little pond. Besides just these three sites, it's just the six cabins. It's kind of like your own little private oasis. Kevin's got his work cut out for him in the next three weeks though. He's got to finish getting the electrical ran to yeah. these sites. He's got to get grass growing, probably get some more stone in here. But well, they're going to be nice. I'd like to be at this spot. This is cool. Another cool spot. You know, I love the fact that they have these six brand new cabins. They were just built last year. And in fact, three of them still don't have furniture. It's coming in the next week or so. They are so cute. Yeah. I mean, these were hand built. I mean, they're absolutely gorgeous. And the nice thing is they have air conditioning. They have a heater if mm -hmm. it's cold out. Now they don't have running water, but we're just a short walk over to the brand new bathrooms where you can go use the facilities, get a shower. Mm -hmm. Really, really nice. And Let's walk just over here a ways. I want to show you something that I think all of us are excited about that's coming in 2023 to Happy Acres. It's a pool! Check it out! I know. So hopefully the pool is going to be installed here in the next few weeks. No guarantees on actual opening date, but the pool arrived last fall and Hopefully digging is gonna start soon and we're gonna have a brand new sparkling pool here at Happy Acres. It's gonna be located right next to the pavilion. And at some campgrounds, you know, you see the pavilion and you don't really see it being used a lot, but- This one's used a ton. 
it is. One of the things I love is they will have it set up with some really nice outdoor furniture. So if you just need a place to go and read a book or maybe hop on the internet and do some work on your laptop, this pavilion back here is a really nice place to actually hang out. And what's one of your favorite things about the pavilion here at Happy Acres, Patty? Oh, the live entertainment. That's right. They come. Several weekends <laughs> throughout the camping season, mm -hmm. they book in local musicians. If you're camping here, you just walk up, grab a chair, or bring your own lawn chair if you want. And on several of those weekends, they actually bring out the Six on James Whiskey Wagon, yeah. which means you can get yourself a cocktail. Mm -hmm. And I'll tell you what, they have some great local performers. Oh, they do. They're awesome. I know uh, we met Mike last night. Yep. Mike is going to be performing at our June campout. If you're interested in coming to one of our two campouts, we have one in June, one in September right. this year. Yep. Um, just go to twdcampout.com and you can book your packages there. But Mike is going to be playing at our first campout and then Pat Taylor is going to be playing our second one. Right, absolutely. We also have a weekend coming up in May. I yep. believe Family and Friends Weekend. Jim and Erica are performing and I believe there's some other dates oh so gosh, yeah if you enjoy live entertainment local musicians you might want to check out the activities page at camphappyacres.com to find out when there will be musicians here Truman and Bess's favorite hangout spot at Happy Acres, the dog park. Well, hopefully this gives you just a real brief preview of where we're going to be this summer. And even if you can't make it here to visit with us and spend a weekend, we hope you'll follow our journey because we're going to document this entire camping season. Yeah, it's going to be different, but it's going to be a fun challenge. Something new. Yeah. Come along, join us, and soon you'll see us on down the road. Bye.